So we're caught up in drama Everybody's talking, everybody's talking We're caught up in problem Everybody's talking, everybody's talking Hey, what's up guys? This is Chris. I'm back again with another review. I've got a little gem for you guys today. I was just playing around with this build and I love it. I absolutely love it. It's a review on the Spins TV Premium Light Redux 1.0. This works or should work on all devices. Uh, also should work for your all versions of Kodi, the 17.3, 17.4 Krypton. Guys, I'm telling you, this is going to be a go-to build for me. I've had it on my fork for a little bit, and I love it, and I think you guys will too. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to download it, install it here in just a bit, but we're going to do the review first. So I'm going to take you through all the menus, sub-menus. We'll check that out. And um, real quickly before we begin, I want to give a quick shout-out to everybody subscribing. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Uh, if you guys have not subscribed, please click on the link below and hit subscribe for me, guys. Um, we do a lot of contest giveaways, and that is the way to actually be able to enter into the contest. You have to be a subscriber first and foremost. Uh, so definitely want you guys to have a chance of winning uh, anything that I do in the contest giveaways. I just gave away a Lil Box Q2, $100 value paid for shipping and sent it out to one of my lucky subscribers uh, but you got let me know how that's going by the way uh, do you like it do you not like it I don't I haven't really talked to you since I've shipped it out um, but let me know man let me know email me whatever um, but this guys comes from the spins TV crew and these guys are doing amazing jobs even with the split up of the misfit mods crew now um, but this is an awesome, awesome build. So definitely, definitely click on the link below. Hit subscribe. Because I'm going to show you guys this build and show you many other builds. I do a lot of streaming device reviews as well. So just all great things that's going to be happening upon us here in the very near future. So let's go ahead and get started, guys. And then, like I said, once I go through the review, we'll show you guys how to download it. All right? So as you can see, you've got a lot of options here. You've got the scrolling menu at the top that keeps you updated there. You've got your widgets right there to the right, the middle, and you've got sub-menus and menus. So let's start out. We've got movies, TV shows. You've got Real to Brid, a 3D 4K menu. You've got box sets. You've got binge watch. You've got sports, kids, horror, Binu. If you're not familiar with Binu, that is the old Phoenix. You've got Bob Unleashed. You've got your IPTV, all your live TV stuff. You've got programs. You've got add-ons. You've got general, system, power, and we're back to movies. All right. If you scroll up once, it takes you to an upper sub menu. Looky here, guys. We've got Covenant movies, Elysium movies, Specto movies, Bob new releases. We've got Salts movies, Electo HD. You got your IMDb top 200. So let's go into the IMDb top 200. Because you guys have seen all the other stuff. Okay. Check it out here, guys. There you go, guys. The tops of the tops movies right now. And you've got your basic ones, Elysium and Covenant. And there's all your menus for Elysium. 
So let's go into new movies. And there's your top rated new movies out right now. And if you click to the left, it takes you up to the power. You've got your favorite section. You've got settings. You can hit view list. So if you want to change it there, you can. You've got view options. You can change the order by ascending or descending. And you have settings there. If you want to get back, all you got to do is go back down. All right, let's go back out. And we've got Bob new releases. So we'll check out that. There's Unleashed New Movies, Val's Hot Movies, and S Cares at the Movies. And there you go, guys. I love this build, it's just really, really nice, very simplistic, but it is awesome. Like I said, I've played around with it for a couple days now, and I really like it. Now, if you scroll up and then up one more time, that gets you to your widgets. And all you have to do is click on the widget. And that's going to bring up Covenant. Now, if you guys have not seen my How to Master Cody video, I would definitely recommend checking that out because you can go in and save yourself a little bit of time with the downloading of the sources. Uh, see how long it's taking right now, 24, 25 seconds. You can actually uh, take some of these providers out, like the IMD Mark, and you can actually even autoplay, so it, it will automatically go to the right source. So there you go, guys. As you can see, working movies. Stop it out of the Just go ahead and hit stop, and that takes you right back out. Okay, and then you're back to your main menu. All right, so let's move on. We've got TV shows. If you click on TV shows, You can go into video add-ons there, or playlist, files, however you want to do it. If you scroll up, you've got Benu TV, My TV Shows, Salts TV, Classic TV, Elysium TV, Specto, Covenant. So let's go into Classic TV. There you go, guys. Some of your classic shows out there, Lord, Airwolf. BJ and the Bear. If you guys have never experienced there's Blue Thunder, any of the streaming device stuff, I mean, you just have so much at your fingertips. This is like going into a major store and like getting any box set that you want that has every single season. Look at their different strokes. So let's just check out one of these. We'll go into one of the menus here. There you go. All episodes. There's season one and two. And we're going to go into season one of Buck Rogers. And there you go, guys. There is season one, episode one, and many more of Buck Rogers. Man, that brings back... There's old Twinkie. <laughs> Brings back a lot of memories when I was a younger kid. So this is just an 
awesome option classic TV you don't see that very much and you have many many other of the classic TV shows and then all the sub menus if you click up there you go same thing you can access these shows basically through the widgets as well so that way you don't have to actually go into any of the menus you just go through these click to the left it takes you back down and then down again takes you back to the main menu next is real to bread I'm not going to go in there once again you can scroll up and you have these menu items here if you click to the right up up and to the right and it gives you your Lease Hub latest movies and so on and so forth. If you click to the left and get you back up to the main section there for TV. So you got TV and movies. Okay. Once again, if you click to the right and down, it gets you back to your main menu. So now we've got 3D 4K. You've got 4K Ultra High Def, Lecto 3D Movies, Doctor Stream 3D and all these options for 3D and 4K streaming movies. And once again, scroll up and there you go guys, you have your Dandy Media 3D. And then scroll to the right and that takes you down to the next widget section. I love this widget section. This is actually really cool. I love how they do that. And then down to the left and down again and it takes you back to the main menu the artistry and fan art and everything in this actual build is amazing that's one of the things I love about it now you can click on any of the uh, menu items there you know these are your box sets check that out 007 collection I mean if you're an Austin Powers fan back to the future bad boys any of these all you have to do is click on them and bam you have the box sets to every single one of them and that's pretty darn amazing guys okay and then you also have war movies electo box sets Stallone, schwarzenegger tarantino i'm a and there's star wars star trek i'm a big tarantino fan so we click on that and it's all of his movies guys check that out how cool is that no more saving dvds or blu-rays or whatever it's all right here at your fingertips and then you backspace and you've got if you go up you've got in progress action adventure animation box set kings brings you all of these based on the genres so some good stuff there, and I'm just curious what kind of box sets we have for war movies. I'm a big war movie buff, too. All right, there's your not really box sets, more so than it's just kind of like a war genre. A lot of great movies there. So good stuff, guys. I really like this. I love the build. Moving on, we got Binge Watch kind of the same thing if you click on or click up excuse me you got Netflix collection HBO box sets so you're gonna find some probably really good stuff there there you go band of brothers ballers boardwalk empire some of the major major um, TV shows there's Deadwood which is a great series Eastbound and Downs great series a lot of great stuff here coming out of HBO you've also got Generation Kill if you've not seen that check it out it's awesome and a lot of other even it's got even Insecure which is one of the um, most updated uh, of the HBO set right now so a lot of good stuff a lot of good content guys you've got sports for all y'all sports fans there's Match Center Sports Channel's been you live. Planet MMA, my favorite. Bob Sports Unleash. You got Sporty. If you click up and you have live matches from Live Premier League, 
click to the right, and that brings you down to Sports World, and you have all of your different sports here that you can check into. If you go down, that gets you back to the main menu. All right, kids. What we do is click on the menu there, and we've got a lot of kids' animated movies. So a lot of great content here, guys. You scroll up, and let's go into Disney Collection. What would a build be without a Disney Collection? There you go. All of your Disney movies, guys. You also have all these other options as well. If you click up, it takes you up to the upper part of the widgets. This is Bob Unleashed Bob's Kids. Click to the right, and that takes you down to Cartoon Crazy Cartoon List. So a lot of good content there. Click to the left, and that gets you back down to your main menu. All you horror fans... You scroll up, you've got Horror Royalty, Classic Horror, Saw Collection, Halloween Collection, and Archangel Horror. Let's go into the Halloween Collection. And there is all of your Halloween movies, guys. This is a great, great, great build because it has a lot of your box sets already there. You don't have to go searching for all the Halloween movies. It's right there, guys. Everything's right there. And it looks like, you know, if you go up, you've got your Saw movies, classic horror, horror royalty. So let's go ahead and check some of the classic horror movies out there of all time. There you go. Exorcist, Shining, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And the list goes on. It is all right there, guys, at your fingertips. The best of the best horror movies. If you go up, you've got Fear of the Dark, best of 2000s. Click to the right. That takes you down to Fear of the Dark, Wes Craven, all of your Nightmare on Elm Streets, and anything else that Wes Craven did. Bet you guys didn't know he did Scream and all his Scream stuff and Shocker, and The Hills Have Eyes. A lot of people don't know that Wes Craven did a lot of this stuff. All right, so moving on, we've got Binyu. Like I said, it's the old Phoenix. You've got Uraeus, Archangel, Binyu Kids, Binyu Live, Binyu Movies, Binyu TV, Taurus. If you go into any of these, you get the Taurus Movies box sets. Once again, Kid Zone. Comedy Zone, so we'll go ahead and check that out. We've checked kids. There's British sitcoms. There's United States sitcoms. I think I almost said shitcoms. <laughs> All right, so, and there you go. A lot of U.S. sitcoms there. Once again, classic TV, guys. All right there at your fingertips. All right, and then you got Bob Unleashed. Well, there's a lot of people loving Bob Unleashed right now. Since they've reamped their add-on, it has gotten a lot of attention. You have these sub-menus here. Click up, there you go. You got Val's Hot Movies right there, all easily accessible. Click to the right, and that takes you down to the Amazing TV. And You've got Griff's Classic TV, Crime TV. You just click on one of those. It's going to bring up the metadata for that, Crime TV. And there you go. All Crime TV related shows right there. Alright, scroll down, and that gets you back to your main menu. Now, you guys know how I feel a lot about live TV. Uh, if you scroll up, you've got Spins Pro, Made in Canada, C-Cloud, 
Film on BBC iPlayer ITV player. Let's just check out Spins Pro here. Hit or miss, guys, a lot of times with live TV. There you go, guys. And you also have Made in Canada. There's 24 hour commercial free music channels. Check that out. And you also have your BBC player. If you go up. You got most popular by channel, iPlayer A to Z categories live. And then you're back down your main menu. Now you have programs. We have Aries Wizard. For all you guys that are Wizard fans, it's right there. You can actually go in and pull this build up based on the Aries Wizard. If you do not like this Aries, uh, if you do not like this build, you can click on Aries Wizard, and it's going to take you into the Wizard, and you can select any of those builds that are there for the taking and you can actually do a fresh install and it will completely delete this one and upload the new one you also have tracks you have your spins tv wizard so if you want to go in and do any adjustments there you go guys you also have url resolver you click up and you got the wizard builds right here so you can switch to any of these click to the right and you have cleaning tools, add-on tools, and all of the great maintenance tools with Spins TV Wizard. I definitely recommend keeping these on right here. That way your build will stay fresh. Alright. You also have add-ons. You have your video add-ons, program add-ons. There's your add-on browser. So if you want to uh, install from zip file or install from repository it's right there if you want to add on feel free to add on any particular add-on that you like that's not already in here let's take a look at video add-ons I love the way that this is laid out this has a lot of great add-ons if you didn't see sports devil that is in this build alright a lot of people love sports Devil for live action, sports action. And you also have a lot of great program add ons as well. All right, general, here is your file manager. So if you want to add a source before you install from zip and in repository, there you go. That's your options there. You also have super favorites. You can search any of the build for anything right here. There's your main search. And you also have weather. Okay, so you can actually set your weather right there, which is really cool. If you go into system, there's your skin, regional. You can change your time format, use 12, 24 hour format. You've got screensaver, master lock, and other. If you click to the left, that brings you up to interface. You also have skin, player, media, and services. If you go into services, go down to weather. Click to the right. Right there it says service for weather information. It doesn't have any. So... You can actually go into these and set a services for that. If you want to just do Yahoo Weather, you can do that, and it'll download for you, and it'll keep you updated based on Yahoo's weather forecasting and so on and so forth. So if we go back, you can see the system information right there. It gives you 
the uptime and what your CPU, CPU usages are. Um, if you scroll over and then go back up and then go into weather, there you go. There's Yahoo Weather for you guys. You can change settings, add-on settings, icons, anything with the weather as well. And then one last thing, if you scroll up, you also have favorites. There's Disney War Documentaries, Sports Documentaries, and all kinds of good documentaries. Live channels right there, Bob Sports, Danny Media Box Sets, Movies, TV Shows, and a lot of great stuff already there for you guys. That's all in your favorites. Okay, and I always recommend hitting the power button and exiting coding this way. When you uh, exit, uh, a lot of times if you will exit this way, it will update any information that you've actually been viewing and it will make it your system run a lot smoother. So definitely do that for me, guys, every time that you exit. Now, if you're going to like back out and watch something else real quick, on maybe your live TV from like say your cable TV or something like that and then you want to go back into Kodi you can do that um, but if you're like exiting for the night I would go ahead and do that and that way all information saved and makes your system run smoother alright so this is it guys we've checked the build out let's take a look and see how to download it so we're gonna go ahead and get out go back to your main menu go into a fresh Kodi as you can see, it's a Kodi 17.4 Krypton. And it is a fresh one. So from here, we're going to go up to the uh, gearbox. Then we're going to go to system settings. We're going to go down to add-ons. Click to the right, down to unknown sources. Go ahead and click enter. That'll bring up your warning box. Just want to click to the left and hit yes. It's just your standard warning, guys, letting you know basically that you're at risk anytime that you download anything to a fresh Cody. That's perfectly okay. I've not seen any malicious viruses or anything like that. Not to say that that may not happen. All right, so once we've done that, we want to go down to File Manager. And then you want to scroll down to Add Sources. I'm trying to go a little slower for you guys that are new. You want to click Enter, and you want to type in this URL in for Spins TV. It's going to be Repo. dot s t v m c dot net okay and then you can go ahead and throw the forward slash in there give you guys a second to enter that just like it is click ok down one and we're going to go ahead and name it dot spins now, anytime you put a dot in front of the name like that, or a period in front of the name, it will put it at the very top of your menu. So once you've got the name there, click OK. There's your spins.spins .spins URL source. All right, so from here, we're going to go ahead and backspace twice. We're going to go down to Add-ons. Go ahead and click Enter. Then we're going to scroll up to the little box there, or Install box. Go ahead and click Enter. Down to install from zip file. Go ahead and click enter. And as you can see, it's right there at the top. We didn't have to go looking for it or searching for it. It was the first thing immediately that we came to. So go ahead and click enter. Down one to repository.spins TV. Go ahead and click enter. And as you can see, the pop up box came up. It says add on installed. And we can move on. Go to install from repository down to spins tv go ahead and click enter down to program add-ons click enter down to the spins tv wizard click enter 
We're going to go ahead and click enter again. That's going to install it. As you can see, it says downloading. And then you're going to get another pop up box. It says add on installed from the wizard. And it gives you a little check mark to the left just to confirm it. So we're going to go ahead and wait. And then the Spins TV Wizard pop up comes up. Just go ahead and hit continue. And then we're going to go into bid menu. Okay, as you can see, it's the latest version of Cody version 17.4. And there's all kinds of builds to try. But like I said, this one is the Spins TV Premium Light Redux. It will work for all devices and probably run pretty smoothly. As you can see, it's a very good looking build. So we're going to go ahead and click enter. And then we're going to scroll all the way down and we're going to do a standard install. Go ahead and click enter. And then it's going to ask you, would you like to download and install? You're just going to hit yes, install. Okay, the first thing that's going to happen is it's going to go through the downloading phase. Once it downloads, then it's going to go through the extracting file phase, which is next. And this always takes a little bit longer to extract all the files. I've got another great review for you guys, just letting you guys know. Uh, the next one I do, it will be another awesome build review. Um, if I can get some kinks worked out, uh, I was going to actually show you uh, this build today. I'm not going to name any names, but it is kind of a newer updated version of one of the older builds. And it is looking very good, but there's some kinks that we have to work out. Uh, and once I do that, I'll show you that build probably in the next day or so. Like I said, we've got some great things coming out. We've got more streaming devices that we're going to be checking out. <clears throat> if you guys want to get in touch with me, as always, I leave my email address down at the very bottom of the description box. And also, you can leave a comment. If there's anything that you all would like to see or any real reviews uh, that you want me to do, uh, definitely email me or give me a comment on what you would like to see and I'll try to do those for you guys. All right, so finally getting down to the end here. And one last thing, make sure you click on the link below and hit subscribe. Don't miss out on your chance to enter into our contest. And then also click on the bell that way you guys are notified of any new videos that I come out with. So once I actually come out with a video, you guys will be the first to get to see it all right so all you have to do is hit force close guys and then you go back into cody as you can see it's version 17.4 once again And there it is, guys. Spins TV Premium Light Redux. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I really, really am proud to be your Cody Source. Take care. You all have a great, great day. Hopefully it's not raining where you guys are. Uh, if you guys are down south in Florida, in that area, in the Caribbean Islands, our prayers and thoughts are for you guys. Uh, and you guys that were affected in Houston, any of those areas, again, prayers and thoughts go out to you all. Uh, God bless you guys. Take care. And you all have a great, great day. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.